Hey guys, and welcome back to Mary J's. So I know it's been a while since I've posted content surrounding Etsy and the print on demand side of things. And the reason for this guys is over the last year, three of my accounts I got permanently banned from Etsy. Now Etsy is notorious for doing this to people guys, but I'm gonna teach you guys how to get back on Etsy. You will not be able to save your listings or anything like that. Now there are some tools and tricks to be able to do that, but as someone that does Etsy stuff, it is really important to not only back up your work, but also to save my future videos in your playlist because you probably will need it at some point because Etsy is notorious for taking people down. Now, I had three different Etsy shops, one in the print on demand niche, which was selling very well, one in the dog space, which is my main company. I sell dog ice creams and barcuterie boards. Check out my website, Shop Healthy Hound. I'll include a link down below. And my third company was a hair company. Now, even though I use different LLCs, different bank account numbers for each of these stores, Etsy was still able to figure out that it was related to me. And so they permanently closed down all of my stores, even though two of my stores had zero violations. Now the violation stemmed from my print on demand store as people can be really picky about the content that goes on there. So this can happen through either reports that clients are making or violations through Etsy. Now Etsy's violations are very finicky. You know, there's a lot of people on Etsy that are selling copyrighted material that get away with it for so long, but it's only a matter of time before their account actually gets banned and taken down. So it's really important to save some of my next videos in your future playlist, guys, because I'm gonna teach you how to get back up on Etsy, even though some of the listings that you made might not work still. I mean, you'll be able to repost everything. It is gonna be like starting fresh, but there are some really cool tools out there nowadays that will help you back up your current listings so that importing them back into your new Etsy shop will be more easy. I don't wanna say incredibly streamlined, but definitely easier than it was prior. So definitely make sure to click the like, click the subscribe, stay tuned guys, because I am back on Etsy, which means I will be back to creating content about Etsy. Etsy is an amazing marketplace for those of you newbies who aren't familiar with Etsy. There is massive potential there in so many different realms, and you can really kind of tailor it to whatever your needs, time, desires, all of the above are. So like I said, guys, click that subscribe button. I would greatly appreciate it.